Welcome to MindSpark, a math learning program. It's personalized and it's adaptive. In next 5 minutes, I'll share how grade 4 student RT uses MindSpark to learn maths. In this session, she's going to learn to compare the turning angles. Before we start, let's see what MindSpark does when a topic is selected. It starts with giving students concept questions for the topic selected. It also has remedials, games and enrichment to the student engaged in different ways but we will come to it later. MindSpark starts with a very basic question. Which arm is turning by a right angle? Aarti without hesitation clicks say. Woohoo! That's a right answer. Aarti surely knows her basics. MindSpark immediately tells her why is it right. Moving on, MindSpark gives her a question to identify the arm of the toy. Aarti thinks for a while and then chooses, yay, another correct answer. To make sure there is no ambiguity, MindSpark makes sure she knows why is it a correct answer. The series of questions continue and Aarti manages to answer them correctly. MindSpark now gives her a challenge question, a higher order question. Aarti does the math and answers 90. Let's see if that's correct. Indeed it is. MindSpark appreciates her for coming this far. Knowing Aarti can even answer the challenge question, MindSpark decides to test her conceptual understanding asking her the measure of the angle. The question is different than what Aarti has attempted. Based on her understanding, Aarti chooses B as the arms are longer. And oh, this is incorrect. MindSpark explanation shows A has greater spread of the angle compared to B, hence has greater measure. Aarti is again given a question to test her conceptual understanding asking her the measure of the angle. Aarti chooses B as the arms are longer. This is incorrect too. MindSpark explains her that angle A and angle B make the same angle. With two consecutive wrong answers, MindSpark is trying to deduce her understanding of the concept. With millions of students' responses, MindSpark maps that Aarti has a greater chance of misconception. Let's see what happens next. It takes her to a personalized learning path by offering a remedial question. MindSpark gives Aarti one more chance to attempt a similar question. Oh, oh, that's a wrong answer in a row. Knowing that there is a misconception, MindSpark is sensitive to keep Aarti engaged to learning this concept. It gives her a story to read. Based on that story, it gives her a question of the concept. As expected, Aarti chooses the correct answer. She feels engaged and rewarded. MindSpark takes her back to the misconception questions. Her answer is incorrect. With this question, MindSpark has decided not to move forward. To remove this misconception, it defines angles to her and repeats the question. Aarti is encouraged to attempt it again. She replays it and this time, it's a right answer. MindSpark like every time, explain the answer. The angles overlaps each other for Aarti to see why the answer is correct. MindSpark asks her a similar questions but without a story. Aarti answers it correctly. MindSpark continues to ask her a similar questions. Aarti aces it answering all of them correctly. By repeating similar questions and remediating the misconception, MindSpark in lesser time with specific questions improves her conceptual understanding. 
Aarti seems to have no it all. But mind spark is not done yet. It takes Aarti back to the topic questions that all the students are attempting in class. It challenges Aarti by giving questions to test her understanding of measure of angles and she solves them correctly. Aarti has successfully completed the topic but Mind Spark seems to have something more in store for her. So, let's see what's happening behind the scene. Oh, Mind Spark sees the need of strengthening her conceptual understanding. It pulls out a game to engage her. Aarti is all set to beat Mind Spark by matching the correct set of measure of an angle. And there goes Aarti. Answering back to back right answers. Woohoo! Lesson learned. Mind Spark is sure the topic is well learned. It's time for Aarti to move on to next topic. See you in the next session, Aarti.